Hello YouTubers, um, we have a S7 Edge here. Um, just thought I'd show you a, a nifty little kind of secret I just found. There's nowhere I can really see on the internet which kind of explains why it did this. And I actually came across it by accident. I've been trying all afternoon to kind of recreate it and figure out why it does it. So what I found was um, on, the, on the always on screen, obviously you can see at the moment it doesn't respond to any touch or anything like that. And this phone just kind of displays one notification, which is a text message just here. Um, obviously you can't view that text message unless you can turn the phone on but what I found by accident is if you just get the phone and you just swipe your finger up and then down so yeah so you can see here I'm, I'm left-handed um, I've got a phone here you've got the always on display I'm um, excuse the bubbles on the screen protector that's quite bad but you know you can understand so if you kind of have it like that and you just sweep it up and then down just on the edge doesn't do it why would I do it there we go you can see there, it gives you a brief little glimpse of what that notification is. So if I press the power button again, it goes back to always on display. So if I try again, just to kind of replicate it, up and down, there you go. It's very gentle you doing that though, aren't you? Very gentle. So if you press a little blue tick, it actually unlocks the phone and takes you straight to that. This is what they call the briefing feed, and you can kind of see all these little things in there which you can... I presume, come up on your always in on screen. I'm going to try it again. That wasn't, it's not been particularly clear. So if you lock the phone again, screen comes up, up and down. There we go. And obviously, if you want to just turn the phone off, just press the off button, turns off. But this is quite a cool feature because it doesn't actually say anywhere that the screen is on, like the HTC. Uh, one M8, for example, you can touch the screen and the screen will pop on. So, um, yeah, it's just quite a cool little kind of secret feature that um, you guys might like to, like to know about. And there we go.